Hello, people. Good evening. Welcome, welcome. It's nice to have you one more time. How are you? You good? Thank you so much for being here. Okay. Hello, how are you? You good? Thank you. Awesome, great. Thank you so much. We will continue practicing this thing that is called a learning English. Don't forget that in your platform, you have the exercise. So you need to do the exercise, right? Don't forget those things, okay? Thank you so much for being here. Thank you, thank you. I just need to check something really quick here. See? Yes, it is recorded. Thank you so much. Let me get the attendance. So I can have your names. I will tell the attendance later on today. That's the way I'm going to do it for the rest of the class. Okay, so I will do it. Uh, Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Very fine. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much for being here. Let me check. Peter. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? You good? Good. Thank you. Oh, sounds great. Thank you so much for being here. Okay, we'll continue practicing. I told you, like, the attendance, I will take that thing later on today. Okay, so thank you so much for being here. Uh, and don't worry, because the attendance, I will take it. I will take it later on today. Okay. Just give me a minute. I can get the information. Okay. This is class number 10, right? Yeah. Class this is number 10. Um, yeah. And this one is. Oh, we're going to have a, neat, a, a, a difficult class today. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Let me show you. Okay. Here we go. Okay, so this is going to be the class for today, people. Thank you so much for being here. Um, section number four, did you have fun? Simple, fast, easy, ending. We're going to have beginners, module number two, and this is class number 10. Yes, thank you so much for being here, okay? Um, again, I will say the attendance later on today. Yes. We're going to work with the past tense. As you may know, the past tense is pretty much to Hi, talk about how, Milagro, how are you? Good. Thank you Thank so you. much. Thank you so much for being here. Well, the past tense, as you may know, we use this thing to talk about things that we did in the past that happened in the past, right? So it's like, it's gone, right? And everything is, is here is about the past tense. So that's the way we use the past tense. And we will continue working on that one, okay? And we're gonna have ED ending pronunciation in here, okay? Yes? Okay, let's continue. We have time expressions when it comes to communicate the past. So when you hear the expressions like yesterday, last week, last week, a year ago, the day, the week before, in 2010, or last month, or in 2002, so that means the past, okay? So these time expressions are uh, for that, communicate that something is in the past tense, right? Uh, so when you see that in your text, don't forget that this is past tense. Please, Rosa Salazar, read these expressions. Thank you. Day, day expression, yesterday, last week, month, year, a year ago, the day, week, before, before in 2025, 20, 2000, 2000, 2000, 
Hmm? To dance a thing. Yes, very good. Thank you so much. So these expressions are to communicate. Oh, this is the past, right? So when you hear them, so you can say, oh, this is the past tense, right? Time expressions, past tense, right? So you will see this when, when people talk about the past, okay? Like, oh, uh, yesterday I went to the museum. Oh, yesterday I ate. Yesterday I play soccer. Uh, last week I went to the beach. Last year um, uh, I celebrated my birthday at the Cameron. Okay. Um, uh, in 2010, I got married. Right. So this is the way we can use this expression when it comes to talk about something in the past. So you can say this expression, adding more details about it, so the person gets, oh, this thing is fully about uh, the past tense. Yep. Okay. Any question about this? Any question about this? No question. Thank no. you so much. Very no good. question, teacher. Wonderful. Okay. Let's continue. We have affirmative sentences. I played. He, she, it played. They played. These are affirmative sentences that we can use when it comes to communicate the thing that is in the past. If you notice here, Mire, ed, ed at the end, ed al final of the verb, right? At mm -hmm. the end of the verb, we have ed. That means regular verb. That is a regular verb that ends with ed. And pronunciation is played, the played, played, okay? Played, I played, he played, she played, it played, we played, you played, they played. Okay, so pronunciation at the end is the. Okay. Okay, so so please don't say don't say play it. Okay, as you know, play it no. Pronounce the verb and then the played. Played. Okay. Played. 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 Okay, let me see. Blanca, play. please read read the, the sentence, please. I played. I played. He played. She played. He played. We played. You played. They played. Very good. And here, here is where we can use the expressions, right? So you can say yesterday. Okay. Okay. Here also you can say um, last week, okay? And also you can say uh, last year, okay? So here you can say just to close the sentence, you can use the time expressions to communicate. So I played yesterday. She played last week. Okay. We yes. played last year, right? So, so we can use these time expressions here in this part, okay? This is, again, yeah. affirmative sentences, and this is regular verb, regular verb. Now, let's take a look at the rules, okay? Right. No. So okay, so what do we have here is we add ed or sometimes just the letter d or sometimes we delete the letter y, no letter y, la borramos, right? And we add e i and ed at the verb. Okay, let's begin with the first one. Okay, most of them, solo les agregamos ED or letter D. Like veces, 
place it is. Love, love. Now, vowels, okay, plus letter Y, then ED, like enjoy, enjoy. Yes? So, mira, this is a vowel, right? Okay, a vowel. ¿Qué es una vowel, Rosa? Rosa Salazar? Vowel? ¿Qué es una vowel? Vowel es una, este, una vocal. Yes, very good, very good. Plus, letter Y. Aquí está la letter Y, right? Yes? So, okay, una letter Y, right? Cuando esos verbs que terminan así, right? Solo le agregamos ED. We just add ED at the end, right? So, enjoy, enjoy. Okay? Now, mira la next one. Consonant. Consonant, right? Plus letter Y. Tengo consonant y luego la letter Y. A esos, mira lo que hago. Okay? Borro la letter Y y le agrego ED. Okay? So, study, study. Yes? So that's that's what, what I do with, with this one. Be careful with this because sometimes we, we, we confuse this one. One syllable verb, one vowel plus consonant, vowel, consonant, double the last consonant plus ed. So we have stop, stop. Bodies. Also, teníamos ayer, creo que era. Yesterday, estábamos hablando with um, Yeah, I don't remember another one. Okay. Yes. Okay. So this sí, one. Is... Cuando era de, de, de los verbos irregulares, se talk, eh, has. Uh, no, I'm sorry. No. It's with regulars. With regulars. Okay? Mm. So, we double the consonant, but with regulars. Con regular verse. Ahí, ahí aplica la rule. Okay? We double. We double the consonant. Yes. And that's what we do here. Okay? And then we have the, the last one, which is two syllables with stress. With the stress in second syllable. So, this is permit. Commit. So the strong the strong voice is at the end, it's here. So the strong sound is here, right? As you may see here, yeah? So this is the strong sound here. So basically what we do there is we double the last consonant. We do the same thing like in the previous one, like here. This is just one consonant, but here we have two. But the the uh, the issue here is that the strong voice is, is the last consonant. So based on that, we double the consonant. And again, these are regular verbs because we have some rules about this, right? Any question about this? Uh, you will you will see this one uh, better when we get into the examples. Okay? So practice uh, about this one, about these um, regular verbs, okay? Any question? No questions? No? No questions at all? What's the meaning of but? Oh, but. It's like when, when people play baseball. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. I get it. Thank you. My pleasure. Yes, I want to show you more examples about this one. Oh, so you can have an idea. Yes, and this one. Uh, and these words that we have here, we're gonna use them forever. So this one, these words are forever. Okay. Uh, so uh, just, just, just be careful with that one because we use with regular verbs, we use quite the same when we have the present. Uh, I'm sorry, the past participle. Okay. Or the present. Uh huh. The past participle uh, option with verbs. Yep. Okay. Excuse me, teacher. Is, eh, en el, 
español una consulta sobre esto. Eh, esta, estas son, son como una regla de, de estos verbos. Yes. Que yes. no todos tienen el misma, la misma exactly. comportamiento. Mm -hmm. La misma terminación, pretty much. Ok. That's, Thank that's you. what we're doing. Yes. And, and again, don't, don't get in like uh, too, too confused on this one, right? How do we learn this thing? By using it. Okay? By using it. That's what... That's the way where we, that we get this one, right? By using it as much as possible. Okay? And, and I hope that we can have the chance to do it. Okay? Let's, let's, let's continue. Continue. Let me show you uh, another example about this. This is the negative. Yes. Let me see. All right. If you notice here, we're going to use the word uh, did. Okay. And also, we are going to use not. And we can say with contraction, didn't. Yes. So we can use contraction for, and we can say didn't. Okay, so I didn't play, didn't play, didn't play, and so on and so on. Okay, if you notice is the verb here, we don't do, we don't do nothing whatsoever with the verb, right? So we have the verb in infinity for because we already have did. So whenever you hear the expression did or the word did, that means that you're talking about the past. Yep. So you hear, oh, I did play, I didn't play tennis. Oh, so that means that the context or the sentence is in past tense. Juan Carlos Lopez Linares. Hello, Juan Carlos. Good evening. Hello. Thank you. Do me a favor. Can you read this example? Excuse me? Oh, please read the examples. I didn't. I didn't play. Uh, con cada una de las palabras. Ante los verbos. Yes, please. I didn't work. I didn't watch, he didn't play, he didn't work, he didn't watch, she didn't play, she didn't work, she didn't watch, it didn't play, it didn't work, it didn't watch, we didn't Play, we didn't work, we didn't watch, you didn't play, you didn't work, you didn't watch, they didn't play, they didn't work, they didn't watch. Thank you so much. Very good. Okay, so this is the way, right? We have didn't with negative statements. Also, you can say did not, did not. But my recommendation is to use a contraction as much as you can. And we have the interrogative, which is this one. Yes, and again, we are going to use did at the beginning, okay? And then we're going to have the subject and then the verb at the end. Okay, so this is what we have. Did I play? Did he work? Did we like? Did you work? Did they work? Like, why the way we work with the past tense? And right now, as you mentioned before, we're working with regular verbs. So the easy part here, I think, like, is because, like, the, the difficult one should be affirmative sentence. Because in affirmative sentences, uh, we use uh, the rules, right? The spelling rules with uh, regular verbs, but if we have the negative and then the interrogative, we just use the opposite that it didn't, and then we can use do with questions, so the rest 
is going to be in the way we used to do this. Any question about this? Everything is clear? Yeah. It's not it's not like a big deal, right? It's something like I can't worry about. We're gonna have this video so you can have more examples or more explanation about how do we use this faster. Let's listen and watch. Hi everyone, in this class you'll learn to sound natural when pronouncing simple past verbs. The ED ending of simple past verbs has three different sounds. Let's listen and practice. These verbs end in T. Worked. Watched. These verbs end in d, cleaned, stayed. These verbs end in id, invited, visited. In order to understand when we'll have a t, d, or id sound, we need to understand a couple of concepts. Voiceless and voice sound. So let me explain that. I would like for you to pay attention to my throat and my fingers. I'm going to put two fingers on my throat, particularly on my Adam's apple. I would like for you to do the same as well. Now I would like for you to repeat after me. Watch, turn, watch, turn, watch, turn. Watch, turn. Whenever we pronounce the verb watch, there is no vibration on our Adam's apple. This is called a voiceless sound. However, whenever we pronounce the verb turn, there is lots of vibration on my Adam's apple. This is called a voice sound. Now let's try to understand the it sound. We will pronounce it whenever we have verbs that have a T and a D sound. For example, visit has a T sound. So we pronounce the past as visited. Land has D sound. So we pronounce the past as landed. Let me show you more examples of words that are voiceless and voice to help you understand this topic better. Another method to use is following this particular sounds. These sounds are voiceless. P, K, S, H. CH, GH, TH, SS, C, X. Let's pronounce these words now. I would like for you to repeat them after me. Helped, looked, washed, watched, laughed, breathed, kissed, danced, fixed. The following consonants have Boys sound L N R G V S W Y Z. Let's pronounce these words now. I would like for you to repeat them after me. Called, cleaned, offered, damaged, loved, used, followed. Enjoy. Amazed. Now it's your turn to practice. I would like for you to pronounce all of these verbs. And then record yourself using the website sound. L. N.
Thank you. Okay, so what do we have here is like the pronunciation. This is one of the difficult parts when it comes with um, regular verbs. La parte más difícil es this one. Como decir los verbs regulars in past tense. ¿Por qué es difícil? Porque pues los leemos a veces está aquí. A veces los decimos help it, look it, watch it. Y así es incorrecto. Ok. En el video, if you notice, el señor estaba poniendo la, los dedos aquí, right? Here. In Adam's apple, right? En la manzana de Adam, right here. Yes. Uh, entonces, hay algunas consonantes pues que vibran. Tienen esa vibración. Por pues eso dice voice sound. Cuando usted dice el verb, suena una vibración acá, right? So you say call, clean, offer, damage, love, use, follow, enjoy, amaze. So usted siente pues que hay una vibration, right? Y el voice es pues el que pues, cuando pone aquí los fingers, le dice el verbo y no produce Down. So, help, look, wash, watch, laugh. Pues no hay vibration. Okay? Ahora, pronunciation in this one. We have it. It is the, is the easiest one. Entonces, toda la mayoría de verbs que terminan en T o en D van a sonar with it. So, want it, need it. Okay? Want it. Needed. So these verse the pronunciations end with eed sound. But this one ends with t. And this one is d, d. So when you pronounce that, okay, si sí necesito que me lo pronuncie. Normal. Trate de pronunciarlo normal y luego agregale el t. Por ejemplo, este, la pronunciation is help. Help. Ahora le vamos a agregar t. So decimos help. Look, watch, watch, laugh, breathe, kiss, dance, sex. So, don't al final, right? Yes. Entonces, cuando usted lo diga in past tense, sí, trate de decirlo. Primero, en normal, right? Como siempre lo dice, y luego agregale al final. Yes. Minimum, right? Esto no es que, o sea, es like, no. It's minimum. It's, it's not beneath, is it? Right? And, and for that, we have the time expression. Okay? You can use the time expression. Okay? So you can say, I watched a movie. Yes. I laughed about the job last week. Uh, I danced at the party last year. I fixed my car last week okay so you can use the time expressions to give more detail. and then no cold cleaned offered damaged uh damaged loved used followed enjoyed amazed okay this is la lengua la otra para en el cielo la boca the cold cleaned offered Damaged, loved, used, followed, enjoyed, amazed. Okay? This, when it comes to pronunciation ending with ed. Okay? Any question about this? Any question about this? Okay, I will say the attendance. Voy a tomar la asistencia. Voy a tomar la asistencia right now. When you hear your name, say prison. García. Arely García. Arely García. Thank you so much. Alicia Arieta Pérez. Alicia. No. Okay. Ana Osorio Cristina. Ana Cristina Osorio. Present teacher. Thank you so much and welcome. Um, Ana García Martínez. Ana García Martínez. 
No, okie dokie. Ana Elizabeth Campos Romero. Present teacher, good Thanks. evening. Good evening, welcome. Eh, Blanca Mendoza Hernández. Good evening, teacher. Thank you so much and welcome. Um, Cristian Ernesto Romero. Cristian Ernesto Romero. I think Cristian told me that he's having a problem while we with his internet connection. Let me see if Christian is here. Christian, no, he is. Okay. What about um, Maricela Perez? Maricela Perez. She was. Maricela. Maricela. Okay. Okay. Um, Elba Granados. Thank you so much, Elba. Nice to have you. Mil, eh, Isabel Sofia. Present teacher. Thank you. Um, Ernesto Arias. Hi, teacher. Present. Good evening and welcome. Thank you. Fatima Hernandez. Present teacher. Thank you so much, Fatima. Jessica Romero. Present teacher. Thank you, Jessica. Welcome. Uh, Jessica Melanie Serrano. Present teacher. Thank you, Melanie. Juan Carlos Lopez Linares. Present. Thank you so much. Julio Cesar Tobar. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Miguel Alejandro Rodriguez Sánchez. Miguel Novides. Nubia Ramírez de Serrano. Present teacher. Thank you so much, Nubia. Rosa Salazar de Fabián. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Eunice Ruiz. Eunice Ruiz. Eh, Jennifer Damisela Flores. Present teacher. Thank you, and Yolanda Andrade. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay, let's continue working with this beautiful thing that is called the EDN. I will play it here so you can listen one more time the information, okay? I don't know. Now let's try to understand the it sound. We will pronounce it whenever we have verbs that have a T and a D sound. For example, visit has a T sound. So we pronounce the past as visited. Len has D sound. So we pronounce the past as landed. Let me show you more examples of words that are voiceless and voice to help you understand this topic better. Another method to use is following this particular sounds. These sounds are voiceless. P, K, S, H, C H G H T H S S C pronounce these words now. I would like for you to repeat them after me. Helped, looked, watched, watched, laughed, breathed, kissed, danced, fixed. The following consonants have voice sound L N R G V S W Y Z Let's pronounce these words now. I would like for you to repeat them after me. Cold, cleaned, 
offered, damaged, loved, used, followed, enjoyed, amazed. Now it's your turn to practice. I would like for you to pronounce all of these verbs and then record yourself using the website bookaroo.com. After you finish this activity, share the link of the recording on our discussion forums. Hi everyone, in this class you'll learn So this is again one more time, uh, the examples that we have always sounds involve a, a strong vibration of the vocal cords like clean, love, close, name, cool. So if you pronounce these verbs, you will find a vibration, right? And on voice sounds, it's less vibration, right? Or, or minimum vibration or no vibration right here. Like watch, laugh, talk, kiss, and ask, okay? Um, now here we have this beautiful thing. Okay, but right. in here is where we are going to have a bunch of exercise. If you see here, we have place the verbs into the correct column below. Yes, there are 10 answers for each column. So let's see. Now let's begin with the easiest one, which is the number three. Eid sound. Okay. Yes. Eid sound. We're gonna work with the number three because that is the easiest one. So everybody, everyone, we have something. We go for the easiest one. Okay. Yes. Okay. So what are the ones that we have in number three? What are the verse? Tell me. Uh huh. Visitor. Okay. Visitor. What else? Invite, invite. Oh, uh, let me see. Invite. What is that? Because I don't see it here. We, we're going to use this Hi. list. Hi. <laughs> yes, this list here. I'm sorry. Okay. So we have this series. That is one, right? What is another one? Mm -hmm. it, it, that's the pronunciation. What? Mm. Uh -huh. Decided. Oh, what is decided? Yes. Decided. Decided. Very good. Decided. Decided. If that is correct. Thank you. Writer. Correct. Repeated. Oh, let me see. So, oh, so yes, repeat it, right? Repeat it. Right. Repeat it. Yes, that is another one. So, mm -hmm. Oh, I'm so, sorry. So, so quick. Oh, stop. I stopped. Yes. No, I'm sorry. No. Taste. Taste it. Very good. That one, yes. Taste it. Taste. Excuse me? Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. No. Why wasted? Oh, okay. Wasted. Very good. Wasted. 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 Yes, we have wasted. Wasted. Yes. The, uh, pasta. Oh, pasta. Very good. The pasta. Yes. Pasta. Um, Stop. <laughs> Stop. Uh, no, sorry. Stop. Stop. Include it. Wesley. Excuse me? Wesley. Included, yes. 
in Cleorete? Wednesday. Um, Wednesday. Excuse me? Wednesday. Repeat. Repeat. Uh, repeat it, yes. We have it here. So, repeat. for example, let me show you. Ask it, teacher. Give me a minute, please. I'm sorry. Teacher, ask. No, I'm sorry. Ask. Falta. Repeat. Uh, I can see that. Yeah, yeah. Jen, why? And then. Oh, very good. Which one? Neither. Which one? Yeah. Landed, yeah. very good. Landed. Ask it. Landed. Very good. Thank you. Landed. What else? Teacher, pero también está ask, ask y load. Eh, no, I'm sorry. This mm. one pronunciation is is. So when I say visit it, yeah. decide it, repeat it, taste it, waste it. And then waste it. Waste it. It is wasted. Okay. Wasted. Wasted. Include. Include. Oh, pasted is here, right? Pasted. Pasted. Okay. We are missing two. Two. Mm -hmm. Here in the list. Whoa. Okay. Logan? No. no. Oh, excuse me. Clear? No, I'm sorry. Gas and would I have hello in life? Mm. Watch it. Okay, somebody wrote in the chat. Let me see. Okay, Anna, I'm sorry to hear that. Yes, we're missing two. You 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 give up? You give up on that? Um okay. watch it. No, ended, very good. Ended. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ended. Sí, yes. le dijimos. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Ended. And just one. Oh, yeah. Ask. No, tiene que terminar con T or con D, David. Right. Oh. Quiet. 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 Yeah. 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 Pronounce los please, Juan. Okay, Rosa Maria, pronounce los please. Visit it. Visit it. Decided. 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 
repeat 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 Sí. Yes. Landing. Yes. Ending. Yes. Flooding. Very good. Entonces todo termina con it. Pronunciation it. Ahora vamos con estos que son difíciles. Yes. These ones are difficult, right? Yes. Please tell me. Okay. Dice right. una, una pregunta. Esto, hay una regla para, para poderlos hacer, ¿verdad? Porque hoy ya le entendí que tenía que terminar con D o D, ¿verdad? Sí, Ah, la D también. Y la D. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Ok. That is the difficult part. Esto es lo difficult part de todo esto, right? Las, re, las rules, yes, are difficult, but these ones, believe me, these ones are difficult. Okay, so let's work with, let's work with, okay, for example, ask. Ask. Okay, I will, I will play the, the number one, right, which is ask. Ask. Okay, that is one. We see some. Ask. Yeah, 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 love yeah, 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 No, yeah, 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 Cracked, yes. Mixer. Mix. Uh, cracked. Okay, that one, yes. Asked, cracked. Okay, very good. What else? What? Watch the key. key. Watch. No. No. Yes. Very good. Watch. Yes. Watch. Oh my gosh, I'm missing the Oh, Oh, Janine. Excuse me? Janine. Shade. Shade. Wash. Shade. Okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Sorry. Wash. What is it? Wash. And this one? Janine. Wash. 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 Yes. Wash. 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 Welcome. Yes. Very good. Welcome. 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 No, we're going over. No. Kyle. Kyle. Call it. Yes. Kyle. Yes. Kyle. Yes. Kyle. Yes. 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 Um, yeah, mess, right? Very good, mess. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, yes, very good, mess. Mix it. Mix it. Welcome. Welcome. Mix it. I hope the first is like. Excuse me? I hope. I love, I love, I love it. Is it cried? Cried? No, sorry, cry now. Damage, damage. Oh, mix. This one? Mix. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that one, yes. Mix. E e Janet. Jan. Jane, 
Join. No, I'm sorry. No, no. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Yond. Yond. Excuse me? Chat. Chat. La cuarta de la. Yes. Cry. Yes. No, I'm sorry. Cried. 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 Tiene que sonar. Ok, entonces yo lo voy a ir diciendo y ustedes me dicen, oh, ese es Mr. Ok. Yes, ok, ok. Ok, ok. okay. 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 Allow. <laughs> yes. No, yes. no, no. Cried. No. No. Damaged. No. Damaged. 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 Yes. yes. Ok, yes. So damaged. 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 Ok, luego tenemos encouraged. Encourage. Yeah. 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 Yes. Okay. Yeah. Encourage. Very good. Encourage. Yes. Yeah. Encourage. Very good. Encourage. Thank you. Then we have jail. I'm sorry. I'm going to. I'm going to delete those. Damage. Mm -hmm. Encourage. I have guest. Guest. Yeah. yeah. Yes. 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 Okay, very good. Yes. Good. Okay. And stopped. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. And very good. It stopped. Okay, very good. Yes. Stopped. Stop. Okay. Stop. Stop. Okay. Stop. Yes. Okay. Creo que nos equivocamos in one. Okay, ya vamos a revisar. Right. Stop. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the rest is like uh the down. Okay. Let me see. Las otras sí. <laughs> Allowed, right? Allowed. Allowed. Yes. Yeah. Right. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Todas estas son yeah, buenas. Ah, son más yeah. fáciles. Hello. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 Relax. Okay. 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 Relax. Okay. Okay. Relax. Exactly. Um, shaved. Welcome. Shaved. Welcome. This. Welcome. This, um, welcome. And yawn. 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 Okay. Uh, okay. Very good. Somebody revisar really good. Because we are going to do with relax, relaxed, and also uh, slip. Okay. Stop. Yes, that is correct. Uh, Excited. I don't mind. <laughs> no, no, we don't have that one. Okay. <laughs> so just just give me a minute. Um, because. Uh, Okay, watch the left. Okay. Exercise, exercise teacher in D. Está bien. Exercise in one. Okay. Okay, just give me a minute because I need to be sure with this uh, relaxed. Okay. I'm sorry. Um, relaxed. Um, Give me a minute. What a no, I'll find it. Okay. Fixed. Okay, do we have fixed here? No, we don't have fixed, right? No. Okay. Uh, Exercise ST. <laughs> 
Yeah, excuse me. Um, Relax. Uh, <laughs> Relax. I relax. Relax, ST. Relax. Relax. Just give me a minute. Just to be sure, okay? I think like all of it, we did it very good. But there is just, oh my gosh. There is only one thing that I, I need to be sure about it, okay? Uh, with this, with this one, uh, with relaxed and also slipped. I guess, I guess those are like, um, let's say, oh, let me see. Jesus, well, I don't find it, okay? I really apologize because, um, yes, I don't, I don't have the, um, the, the, the list here. So I can check that. Because it's like for me, for example, encourage, encourage tendría que ir aquí in this part, okay? Encourage tendría que ir here, okay? Encourage. Encourage. Okay, tendría que ir here, encourage. With the sound and it's lift, tendría que ir acá, okay? Is this lift? Tendría que ir here, okay, in this part. Um, okay. Okay. Uh, slipped. okay, because of the of, of the ending sound, damaged, damaged. And that one yes. Oh, guess, stop, miss, wash, as, cracked. Yeah, but this one should be like like this one. So the difficult part here, people, is to identify this one. Okay, so if you notice with the and the sound, so it's quite difficult. So uh, my recommendation is, this one is easier because all of them ends with E, right? Visit it, but this one is asked, cracked, washed, washed, mixed, mixed, mixed. damaged, mixed. guessed, damaged. stopped, flipped, Stop. and here with the loud, cried, yelled, healed, love, relaxed, shaved, welcome, and yawn. Yeah. Okay. All of these verbs are, are quite, uh, um, let's say, easy to use, but the difficult part is the pronunciation. Okay. So my suggestion and my recommendation is practice as much as you can. Okay. So you can, so you can get used to them. Let me see. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. Sí, nos habíamos equivocado, okay? Let me show you. Let me show you. Wait. Show you. Okay, nos habíamos equivocado en two, okay? And this one is ah. damaged and encouraged, okay? Here, this two. So here we're going to have stiffed and relaxed, okay? Those are the ones that we need to change, right? Damaged and encouraged. These ones are with the sound, okay? So allowed, pride, damaged, encouraged, ill, killed, loved, shaved, welcomed, yawned. And then the rest, everything we got it right, okay? Like asked, cracked, guessed, missed, mixed, relaxed, dipped, uh, stopped, washed, and washed, okay? Yes. And then the other one with eat sound. Okay, so as you see, right, it's not a piece of cake before. Okay, so my recommendation is uh, practice little by little, okay? I know it will be difficult, but please, uh, practice little by little. So don't say, ask it. Don't say, uh, allow it. No, okay, try to say it normal and then add the sound like the and t or eat at the end. Okay, so you can say decided, asked, allowed. Okay, so at the end, if you notice, it's not the strong pronunciation, but it's minimal there, right? Loud, asked, decided. Okay? Any question about this? Any question about this before? Oh, don't forget to practice tomorrow. 
tomorrow we have classes, okay? So we have classes tomorrow. So stay, stay here tomorrow in the class, okay? Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you. Good night, you, and we will see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. For everything. Good night. Take care. Thank you, thank you. Good night.